In semen analysis, we look at the count, motility and morphology of sperms. And today's video is about normal and abnormal morphology that we encounter when we are looking at sperm morphology in a sample. A normal sperm looks approximately like this. It has a head, a mid piece and a tail. The tail is very important for motility, for movement. If the tail is shaped well, then the sperm moves forward in a linear direction. The mid piece, this section here is also very important because that's where the mitochondria is present. Mitochondria gives the sperm energy to move and to perform other activities. Now, the head is the topmost part and that's where the DNA from the father is encapsulated it's present there tightly capped there so it's a very important procedure where we look for sperm morphology because any defects in the sperm whether it is tail mid piece or head could lead to fertilization errors or could lead to poor embryo formation could lead to miscarriages and also implantation failures